Hello everybody and once again welcome back to Financify YouTube channel today in this video I'm going to show you how you can trade P2P in Bybit app so make sure you follow my step till the end. First thing first I assume that you have already downloaded the Bybit app and now once you open it and yeah make sure you are already logged in as well and now right after that you will be able to see the interface or dashboard of the Bybit apps on in the screen where you can see there is a assets option at the bottom right corner of this dashboard which is distinguishable by its wallet icon so let's tap on that wallet icon or assets and now you can see there is a deposit option so let's tap on the deposit and finally you can see there is a p2p trading at the second so you need to tap on the p2p trading and make sure you verify yourself first and now you can see there is a two options first one is buy and another one is sell so if you want to buy the cryptocurrency then simply tap on the buy and now you can see there is a two sellers over here so you simply need to tap on it and you can see i haven't verified myself for now so you simply need to tap on it and you need to communicate with the trader and once you complete all the transaction and the formalities then yeah, you'll be able to buy your cryptocurrency from here successfully and if you want to sell then simply tap on the sale and you can see there is a lots of options to sell your cryptocurrency so just choose any of them but i recommend you to choose the first one because you will get the appropriate price over here so once you have done the process gonna be same you simply need to communicate with the traders or the buyers and yeah you will be able to sell your cryptocurrency in here successfully so basically this is how you can trade p2p in bybit app and if you still encounter an issue during this process feel free to leave a comment and i'll be happy to assist you if you found this pretty helpful please give it a thumbs up and if you are new to this channel make sure to hit the subscribe button and set the bell icon to on so that you can stay updated with our latest content thank you for watching and i'll see you next time